and the mm -hmm. lights, the music, mm -hmm. the romance. Ah, oh, Paris, right there, just for us. Yes, <laughs> just for us. <laughs> it was so warm. It was the warmest night in March Paris must have seen. I mean, of course, both of us know that uh, your rich Duke friend wouldn't have taken you on a sightseeing tour boat with dinner, little orchestra. <laughs> <laughs> well, my Duke never existed. You do. Thank you. Thanks for bringing me to Paris on your spring break. Thanks for making it special. You're welcome. Well, I'll get with that singer again. Sounds like he should be in an opera. Maybe he is. A little late to be warming up, but... Go. Thank you. I really don't mind. I think it's kind of neat. Sort of the way I always imagined it would be when I was in Paris with my lip. To you. And to this wonderful hotel. Uh, well, it's it's nice, but, you know, I imagine in your fantasies, your Duke took you to places that were a little more classy. I don't even remember. Look, were you kidding Duke? I told you, that was totally bogus, okay? All my wild times were fantasies. <laughs> Honest to God, the more I open up to you, I see how my whole life has become one big old lie. <laughs> No, does that mean, oh, does this mean we don't go jump, jump into the fountain where you and your duke strip down and wade it in? No. I was lie to. Um, you know, I gotta tell you something. I'm, I'm a little scared that after this trip, you may hate me. Oh, no. No, Kelly. But... Just so many lies, Joey. Kelly. Hey, hey. Look at me. Kelly. I could never hate you. I love you. Excuse me? You heard me, and I meant what I said. I love you. But I told you so many lies. <sighs> Was a lie? You really did go to that convent school. And although we just drove by, didn't go in, old uh, Sacre Coeur didn't look like the most wonderful place to grow up. Tell me about it. Yeah. So it's no wonder you started making up those fantasies about running away and dating a duke and a politician and a plumber and a rock star and a... I was really lonely. You can, you can imagine how well I fit in. I, I didn't. I, I had no friends and, and the teachers, they, none of them liked me. And you know, by then my mom had already been committed. All I could hang on to were my letters from Dorian. And I was here, I was in Paris. I was in the city of lights, the, the cultural center of Europe. And I might as well have been in Timbuktu because I had no one to do anything with or, or. Come on. What? We're going. Where? We're going to retake the streets of Paris, then let's go. We're going to, um, fulfill one of your fantasies. Let's go. Uh, nice. <laughs> Beautiful. So, um, is this the fountain where you and your duke strip naked and jump in? Yes. That's what I'm saying. Oh. Joey, my Joey! What are you doing? What? Are you doing? <laughs> 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 well, 
I know I'm no duke, but I um, did promise I'd make the fantasies come true, so... Come on in. Water's fine. No. No, you are crazy. It is freezing. No, it's not. It's, 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 it's heated or something. It's a heated fountain. Take off your shoes. Come on, trust me. Trust me. But you are asking for it, mister. Do you realize if we get caught, we are in huge trouble? Oh, my God! Oh, my God! You're... Oh, it is warm. <laughs> Why would you do that? I can't believe it. I'm jumping. Come here, please. You're crazy. You having fun? Yeah. I'm having fun. <laughs>